right on this damn pizza box. We just go about 40 feet to the south, we put the sluice box in, and then we'll start cutting the holes and getting everything set up. All right, all right, let's okay. go. All right. Going to a new hole. Halfway through the stormiest season in 100 years, Vernon Atkinson is on the move. Following a rich vein of gold under the ice, he could be playing with fire. We'll put the show on the road. This winter, we've been killing it. Absolutely primo gold. That's the good news. Unfortunately, the trail is headed directly towards a huge open water lead. This thing is massive. But if I want to hit 200 ounces, I got to drill a new hole and keep following. We'll be pressing our luck, but that's where we got to go. What a beautiful hole. That is a nice one. Got everything moved over here to the new area. Right now, we're all set to get a diver down. If I'm going to roll the dice on a hole this close to that lead, I've got to get as many hours on that box as I possibly can. So that's the plan. Tip, fate, and load up on hours. I'm going to send Gary Simpson down first. And if he can get us on the gold, we can double up with old Gary right after that. I think we're going to do this. I'm ready to roll. Let's get to it. All right. Awesome. Yeah, roger that. Okay, we gotta get to work here. Hey, Gary, can you tell if it looks like it's been worked? No, it hasn't been worked. All right, all right. Actually, this stuff right here is pretty cool, huh, Gary? You see that? Come on, this all looks good. That's the shallow stuff we were looking for. See it all right there? See it up in here? Uh-huh. Nice looking good, Gary. When you're hot, you're hot. And we're smoking right now. We keep following this trail, and it's delivering. My only concern is the ice is getting thinner, and that lead is getting wider. So this is turning into a game of chicken. But miners like to live dangerously, especially this one. It's all through here. It just keeps coming out. Look. See it all? Look at all that. Yeah, this might be that primo ground we've been looking for. Matter of fact, that might be the name for it. Primo Gold. If it plays out, that's what we're going to name it. Yeah, yeah, I hear you on that. We should be able to do some damage down here. Woo! So, Gary. Yeah? Why does the ocean roar all the time? Why does the what? Why does the ocean roar all the time? Why is that? Well, if you had that many crabs on your bottom, you'd roar too. <laughs> all right. Vernon Atkinson's laughing all the way to the bank and in the face of danger as the operation marches towards an ever-growing lead. Okay, well, you got uh, five hours and 20 minutes. And it's time to come up. Uh, all right. Throw a little gold out there in front of your nose and uh, have a hard time getting you up. I mean, I don't know what it is. I kind of like it down here. You're an iron man. Or a gold man, I should say. We're getting closer and closer to that open lead. And with all our equipment up on that thin ice and our divers underneath it, we've got to be extremely careful. So we're going to take a break, check the box, and make sure the gold is as good as we think it is. Holy look at all that. Yeah. You see all that right there? Oh, yeah. Got a lot of gold in there. Good gold. 
Love it. All I got to say is booyah. Our hot streak just keeps going. So we're going to keep creeping closer to that lead as long as the ice holds up and the guys are willing. But we'll need to keep our eyes and ears open at all times. The hole is looking really good. We'll uh, send Gary down to finish up the day and put some more gold in the box. All right, Gary. Get after it, buddy. All right, I'm working my way back towards the hall. All right. Oh, this looks like some good stuff. That looks like it's pretty easy judging right now, huh? Yeah, real easy judging. Moving fast, running a lot of material. See this little area right here? The hole keeps coming out. That looks good. This might end up being an extremely good hole. This is looking good, packing the box full. <sighs> That's some nice, clean gold right there. After pushing closer to the open water lead, the question is, will it lead Vernon's team to make a goal? Weigh it up, Gary. Let's see what we got there. All right, here we go. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18.04. 18.04 ounces is worth over $34,000. Proof that if they can outlast the thinning ice, this spot may lead Vernon straight to the top. I'm telling you, buying 56 was the best move I've ever made in my life. Yeah. I mean, that's going to be my retirement program right out there on 56. More money, more money, more money. This claim just keeps on delivering, and this new spot might be the richest of all. I'm hoping the lead doesn't expand any further. Otherwise, both our underwater ATM and our safety will be at risk.